weather alert in place. Laura, this is across the area, but this also could affect uh, what's, what we're seeing there at the University of Chicago. Yes, um, especially if some of these thunderstorms are severe. It is possible that we still at least have that stronger edge of the scale, the storm where we have winds of 40, 50 miles per hour. We need 60 miles per hour to trigger a severe thunderstorm warning. I've been watching this line of storms approach the area, slowly weakening as expected, but we still may have at least a couple of intense thunderstorms. Between 7 a.m. and 11 o'clock, downpours, a thunder, a brief break, and then some more thunderstorms here this afternoon between 1 and 5 o'clock. And some of those thunderstorms could turn severe with all threats here. Large hail, damaging wind, and an isolated tornado risk. These three risks right here is going to be tagged with the afternoon round. This morning's round, the biggest contender is going to be the high winds. I've been seeing some winds of 50 miles per hour with this line of thunderstorms and moving off toward the east. We're still um, not quite to the Chicago area just yet, but closing in on LaSalle County out ahead of that a couple of downpours, uh, but that main line of thunderstorms still well off toward the west. In fact, for Chicago, over 107 miles still to go. So I still think that we've got a couple of hours before we see those storms in our area. Along the path, moving in an environment that may keep uh, that potential for those gusty winds where we have this level two risk. This is going to be that focus for those afternoon thunderstorms where we could see the large hail and also that tornado risk. Moving ahead in time, here we are at eight o'clock. Storms moving into our western tier counties, our far west counties. And then by the nine o'clock hour toward Aurora, Kane County, toward Kankakee, Key, Joliet, uh, Chicago, not quite in our area yet, but by 9, 10 o'clock, that's when I do expect those thunderstorms in the area moving out of here by 11, then a brief window for a break to reset, adjust, and then several more thunderstorms break out for the afternoon. Right now, if you're heading out the door, 50s and 60s, it's a mild morning, a calm one. We go to 75 today with those rounds of thunderstorms. It will be fairly breezy too. winds from the southwest between 20 and 25. Some more thunderstorms in the forecast for tomorrow, especially late to high near 80 degrees and then a big drop in temps. We go to the 50s for highs on Thursday. Wet weather expected dry on Friday. Showers likely again on Saturday, but mom's day will be bright and beautiful with a high of 70 degrees. 624.